Watkins Wildlife, and today we are going to be reviewing the Bronx Zoo Reptile Room in New York. Please note that I was not able to film all the animals' enclosures because of the crowds. Starting off with one of their enclosures is the Anaconda enclosure. Now everything looks great, it's very big, and it does have the light, and it does have a hide in the back near the tree. This is a boa constrictor enclosure. It does have water there, and it does have a hide in the back. There he is basking. Here is a pretty nice looking enclosure. It is for an alligator and it is pretty roomy and they can bask because they do have the UVB lights and the heat lamp. So everything looks good here. Here is an enclosure for baby American alligators. It looks pretty nice and also they can bask with the UVB and heat light. There is an Egyptian tortoise in this enclosure, and it does have the UVB and heat light, which is good, and he is right there in the back. And that lizard is fake. Here is a black monitor enclosure, and everything looks good. They also have a UVB light and heat lamp, so it looks great. Here is a bearded dragon and frilled lizard enclosure. I haven't seen an enclosure like this before where there's two species in the same enclosure, especially when it comes to bearded dragons and frilled lizards. They are both a solitary species, but they do share the same environment, and if the enclosure is big enough, then they won't fight. So hopefully if they don't fight, it should work out just fine. This is a Gila monster enclosure. They are one of the two venomous lizard species on the planet. They do also, in the wild, naturally spend time with each other in dens. They do have the water available, and they have the UVB light and heat light, so good job. This enclosure is for a rhino iguana, and everything looks pretty good. It is roomy, and it does have that UVB light and heat light. Here is the rhino iguana now, and overall, I can say that this amazing reptile room is a great place to visit if you like reptiles.